Hi, Glows Gang. How you all doing? I hope you guys are fine, good, cute. Mm -hmm. And welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I am Maureen Glow. Please kindly support me by clicking on the red button below to subscribe and on the notification bell icon for notifications. Okay, without no delays, let's get started. You guys, Grammy's award has come and gone, but the best boss it created has remained. Guys, <laughs> y'all yeah, know when Bonaboy won the award or the Grammy award, he said the award is for all Africans, meaning it's for me, you, and every other African out there. But the Ghanaians are not okay with that, guys. <laughs> They've been trolling, bashing, dragging, shading their artists. As a matter of fact, they've been laughing at them, saying all sorts, you know? And Shatawale was not okay with that. He took to his social media handle to react to it. Fiumi at his fellow Ghanaians, Shatawale wrote, and I quote, Enough is enough of Ghanaians insulting Ghana artists. If you feel we don't sing well, go and stay in Nigeria so they can sing for you. At least that will buy you a dream house. Kwasha for, sorry if I'm not saying that right, I'm not a Ghanaian, okay? <laughs> Especially entertainment programs. Hmm, guys, he was really, really angry. Like, he was really, really angry. I wish I can play the video for you guys to watch, but I can't because I don't want to get copyright claim on this video, okay? Not on this video, honey. But anyway, he did say something in the video that he made. And he said, my Grammy is my real estate properties. And that's what's up, okay? And yeah, you guys, let me know what you think concerning this in the comment section below. Anywho, talking about Grammy Award or Banner Boy winning the Grammy Award, Banner Boy's ex-girlfriend identifies with him. And she's no other than actress Princess Chingu. Guys, take a look at this video and I will be back. When the bed do the entire body. <laughs> Wait, that's not how they say it. Wait, how do they say it? When the bed do, bed do, bed do. That's what I said. Bed do. You say bed. You say bed. I don't know what you're saying, but it's not what I'm saying. When are you gonna release the other song? Which one? Do you know how many songs? No, I mean the one you did when you were the one she did when you were with me. Bye. Still on the Grammy Award, Kasala, self proclaimed actor Uchema Duagu reveals to Davido what he needs to do in order for him to win his own Grammy Award. Congratulations to Bonner Boy and Waste Kid. Obio, listen to this prophecy. You are very talented. God is saying if you marry Choma this year, you go win Grammy Award because you are talented. Congratulations to you. Moving on real quick is Kemi Olu Lawyer. Guys, Kemi Olu Lawyer reveals that the only civilized BBN ex-housemate or housemate with the most civilized fan base is Dorothy. <laughs> According to Kemi Olu lawyer, Dorothy Bacho is very civilized and also has a great fan base in Nigeria. She disclosed that Dorothy Bacho will be one of the female who will be the leaders in the future. This young lady and her fan base are the most civilized in Nigeria. Keep on fostering positivity. Watch out for her. These are the female leaders of tomorrow. I will make an interview request with her soon. Okay. <laughs> That's coming from um, Kemi Olu lawyer is a lot because we don't get to see this all the time. And y'all know Kemi Olu lawyer now. So, congratulations to you, Dorothy. I mean, <laughs> I feel we should congratulate you because, like I said, we don't get to see this from Kemi Olu lawyer all the time. So, when it comes, it's <laughs> something to congratulate someone for. Anyway, guys, let's move on. Moving on is singer Yemi Alade. Guys, singer Yemi Alade took to her social media handle to react to a weight watcher who claimed she has added so much weight. <laughs> Guys, Yemi Alade posted a video of herself shoving so much food into her mouth and captioned it, Yes, and I will eat you too. Hashtag love yourself. Hashtag you are enough. Take a look at the epic reaction video and I will be back. You 
guys, Big Brother Ninja V finally bears her mind on global jollof situation. Guys, she tweeted, Unpopular opinion, Nigerians in the UK cook better jollof rice. Mimi, they cook better jollof rice than Nigerians in Nigeria. <laughs> Be the judge, guys, and let me know what you think in the comment section below. But as for me, oh, nah, nah, V, I disagree. How can now? <laughs> How can Nigerians in the UK cook better jollof than the ones in Nigeria? Have you forgotten the firewood, please? <laughs> Anyway, that is V's opinion and yeah, she's entitled to it. Okay, so you let me know what you think in the comment section below. By the way, Big Brother Ninja Kaisha cries out to Nigerians about getting her whole life back. Guys, she tweeted, I need my whole life back, not all that glitters is gold. Yeah, you're right, Kaisha, not all that glitters is gold. But I guess it's too late now, sis. I guess it's too late. Someone said, Kaisha, if Handy meet you, talk. Let's do a GoFundMe for you. <laughs> anyway, I really hope Kaisha is fine. I hope she's fine. Y'all know fame can be really stressful. The idea of dressing up, pleasing the public, photo shoot and whatnot can be really draining, you know? So I really hope she's fine. You guys, entitled James Brown shades Bobrisky for not keeping to his promise. Like, he said Bobrisky promised him 200k every month, but all he gave to him was 100k, and that was once. Okay, anyway, that was before he became popular, alright? And yeah, take a look at the video, and I'll be back. Dressed by my content, my glory. Oh, come on, oh, do one. Oh, they he call me on top for they tell me. Do you know one thing? The funny part of it, when somebody call you and tell you that I help you in the past, why will you? Why will you be thinking you help me in the past? Why you not even finish it? You promise somebody two hundred k. I'll be giving two hundred k every month. She she will drop you don't know. Who do I fake? Ah, you promise? It don't mean me. You promise because I'm a big boy now. That time you promise, James. I'll be giving you two hundred k every month. The only money I saw was 100k and it showed his face and slapped my face in public. The publicity for who oh, I beg you today somebody 200k. I'll be giving you 200k every month. She she will drop or you don't know. Oh, do I fake? Ah! You can fake for Africa. Kill you the official already. Ah! Yo guys, it seems President Buhari finally eats to Comedian Akororo's request. In case you don't know, yeah, Comedian Akororo requested that President Buhari congratulates Whiskey and Bonner Boy for winning the Grammy Award. Oh well, it seems he has done so because the Federal Ministry of Information and Culture Nigeria congratulates Whiskey and Bonner Boy for winning the Grammy Award. Okay? Yeah, in case you've not seen Akororo's video, I'm going to show it to you in a bit. But before then, I'd like to say it's about it from me with this video. Okay? And I hope you enjoyed it. So please subscribe to my channel. Click on the notification bell for notifications. Don't forget that. Like this video. Comment, share, do all the good stuff to this video. And yeah, until I come your way next time, I remain your girl, Maureen Glow. Peace out to this. Bye bye. Please wait for the video at the end. Okay, bye. Mwah. Yeah, hello. That is your boy, Akbororo. They come back with too much swagger, too much anointing in case you don't know. Why some call me Royal King? See, eh, for my son, and I would already celebrate the calm. Say, eh. Uh, our people win Grammy. Not the only one person I win. Eh? Bona boy whiskey. Tewa salvation, we go to here, blah blah blah. The the, like the joy, eh? Bona boy just stand on Bona boy home because I be now the global album. You understand? Most stand on now. Now my message now they go to that person where they unto our president and uh, stuff for social media, especially for Instagram. I mean, no verse. Even though our president could say busy, say no, no, say bona boy, and the whiskey, the win Grammy. You were in the hand only this thing. What did, what did do you do? Why you never post them? This country, I know. See, who know they do us well normally? Not be saying that they do us well. For the past 10 years, I've been many years there. See, we just, we, we just, come here, I mean, I don't make me this. You were in, there in charge of Buari Ando. You were busy that you're in charge of that this thing. Post these people stuff. You don't need to be Grammy. You take Grammy in a play. Congratulate them. 
Tell our president, I don't know you want to tell him. Tell him. Say, but that boy, whiskey that some people, they, they win Grammy. What be this one, Seth? Congratulate them. You know, you don't change anything. See, we know, we know they complain for things when they do us. Eh? We know we they used to have. But we win Grammy. We win Grammy. We win Grammy.